Okay, so we have weekend league monthly rewards. I did not very win very many games. That's okay. Hopefully we get something good. I only got 15 gold player packs and two elite player packs because... So how many weekend leagues did I actually finish? I did not actually finish a weekend league. I got 13 wins the most recent one. I got 10 the win the one before that. Both times I didn't finish. I think I got seven before that. I don't know how many wins I got, but this is the rewards that I ended up with. I also quick sold 500 training. So we are just going to rip through these. We're going to pull Darren Waller and it's going to be sick. Um, I'm excited. I hope you're excited. And uh, yeah, next month, hopefully we get some more rewards because <laughs> this month was not it. Elite already. W. Aaron Jones. Great. Excellent. Honestly, a couple of these cards I already know that I need for Barry because I'm still finishing up building Barry Sanders. I bet Kenny Clark gets a uh, rising star tomorrow, so that's good. Um, but other than that, so far, not great. Okay. Amos, another elite player that I need for the Barry sets, so that's fine with me. Uh, oh, gosh. Okay. Not great. Listen, not great, but pretty good. So I got a couple of pieces that I know I need for team affinity sets for the team diamonds. Kenny Clark should be good eventually. Amos and Jones, I both definitely need as elite players. So I will take that actually. Okay, let's try for our two elite player packs. I don't know what comes in these. Is it just one elite player? Yeah, Kendall Fuller. That's actually a good card. He actually comes with quite a bit. He's actually worth quite a bit because he's that promo and a baby legend lit. Actually, this Morton Anderson is way better than the kicker that I'm using currently. So we will, we will take it. <laughs> we will take it. Look at that kick. Oh, it's the same as Joey Sly, but way more accurate by 11. Done and done. More. welcome to the team. All right, that's our weekend league rewards for the month. Tough. So I've been ripping the 500 point right here, get a player pack over and over and over now for a little over a week. Uh, with three goals in mind. One of them is to build Barry Sanders, uh, hopefully for free or for pretty cheap. Uh, Isaiah Simmons for free or pretty cheap, and then build uh, 50 players. So the way you're doing it is you're ripping uh, 500 coin packs, and then you're rolling 62 to 64s, or 62 65s into 60 to high silvers, high silvers into low golds, low golds into high golds, and then you're using all of those pieces to build the theme diamonds to build Barry. Um, 75 to 79s that don't go into the theme diamond sets. I'm putting into the fresh players to build um, 50 players. And then any, th any rookie is going into the Isaiah Simmons. I'm doing all three of them at the same time. Most people do one at a time, but I'm doing all three of them the same run through right now. So I started last week with 187K. Um, I have played the game, so I've gotten weekend league rewards. I've gotten, you know, solo challenges, head-to-head -head games. I've done all of that cumulatively. I've also built Devontae Adams. But on top, but besides that, so technically for 40K, add into the Devontae Adams build, you're talking, I'm, I'm technically up uh, coins. Um, and then I have, I'm up on coins if you count Devontae Adams, the money I spent on him. And I have also added 13, 11, 8, 13, 10, 10, 14, 11, 17, 11, 12, 16, 10, 12, 9, 16, 12, 14, 11, 12, 13, 15, 13, 8, 15, 15, 11, 11, 15, 11. So that's how many theme diamond pieces I've added. And then in the 50, I have added... 28 out of 32 for Calico. So I'm almost there on Calico. When I sell him, the next one will be Reggie. And then on top of that, I am also at 49 out of 65 on Isaiah Simmons. So I have done all of that and still actually profited coins. But, so I've gotten all of those pieces and Devonte Adams um, and I'm almost done. So I predict by this weekend, I will have Barry and I want Barry because I run split close. So having a really good receiving back like Barry in there will be great. Calico I need to build, I need to finish off, I need to get his power up and I'm not paying 300k for it. And then once Calico's done, my next goal is Reggie Bush to put him next to Barry in my backfield and that will be wild. And then Simmons, because I'm still using uh, Xavier McKinney and Terrell Edmonds, so Simmons will be great to replace both of them. But that's what I'm doing and it's working. You guys will see, I, you know, granted, like I said, I've played the game, I've gotten good morning Madden packs, I've gotten weekend league rewards, but generally speaking, to stay at the same coin spot, and have also added Devontae Adams. I'm happy with that. And the reason is 
is because I've pulled a Tyreek Hill power up. I've pulled two Jamal Adams power up. I've pulled Khalil Max power up. I've pulled Derwin James's power up. I've pulled George Kittle's power up. I have pulled a lot of really expensive power ups and those have basically funded me along the way. And then I have, and I actually forgot to mention this, but on top of all of that, look how many I had. I had only the power ups that were in my lineup. So call it about 20 power ups when this started. I now have 174 power ups. So I've done all of that. I've added all of those pieces to the team affinity. I've added all of those pieces to Isaiah Simmons. I've added all of those pieces to to Tyrone Calico. I've added Devonte Adams, and I've also accumulated an extra 150 thousand or 150 power ups, which is easily easily 250, 300, 400 thousand coins if I were to sell all of those power ups right now. So. If you guys can't tell, doing this get a player method takes forever. I've been doing it for about a week and I'm not done yet, but it's super profitable if you have the time.